Hey guys, Sacramento Joe 3 here, and today I'm playing on our new realm. Today I'm playing on our new realm. It's, it's just called BS because of the card game. We don't really have a city name or anything, so yeah. But uh, we have a lot of people from our last realm, Fusain, and that one was a good one, so we're hoping this one works as well. And, uh, yeah, right now I'm just working on this path to the plantation that I own. We have different flags for different places, but, uh, right here is the main... Also, this is because it's Christmas time. I don't really have a texture pack on, but... Oh, crap. So anyway, yeah, this is uh, this is the main hub right here. This is where we started living. Remember when the realm first started and everything? So yeah. Uh, let me sleep till daytime. We also got a beacon. We actually have two, but the second one's in his inventory. I think he is AFK right now. I could guess maybe the creeper farm but yeah we've had this up for like maybe about a month or so now so yeah um that right there is caleb if you guys remember him cl empire is his channel and uh this is his storage i'm sure he doesn't care if i show it off but uh i don't know what's up there but down here i ain't gonna show you because i don't want to lose any of his blocks but um yeah he has a big storage and it goes down really far down. I could actually show you somewhat, I'm just not going to break the floor. Anyway, um, yeah, so let me go down here. We got this little elevator system. And so this is the, uh, the main BS, we don't know what the nation's called right now. But Ethan's the leader of, like, everything, I guess, because he owns the realm. And we all have our mini parts of it. This is the flag. It's, like, the communist flag, I guess. The last one kind of looked a little fascist in, on Fumsane. But, uh, this one is that one, I guess. So, <laughs> yeah. Here was the first farms. And then I built this path because I thought I might as well have something to make it feel a little more better. Over here is the um, spawn. has all the members of the realm. I can't do that though because some people on here don't want their names to be shared. So I will not do so. But this is also uh, another way up, which is just... We should make that look better someday. But uh, Sheep farm, a mine... A boat, Charlie's boat, he, uh, I never really know what he's doing when he's online. I mean, he's worked on the bottom of the boat, but I don't know what else he's planning on doing. So, yeah. Anyway, this is Caleb's property. He filled in part of the lake here and then mined down part of the mountain. And then he's also mined inside the mountain here. And, uh, yeah, so this big massive pretty tunnel here like it's beautiful this is actually going to be leading down to his uh let me turn this down just a bit i assume you guys can still hear me but i never really know as you see it's not entirely finished but he's almost there maybe but all the way down here leads to a staircase that goes all the way up and where does it lead Exactly. Uh, I hate this thing. It does not want to stay on. But, um, it leads all the way over to a storage that I just showed you, but I didn't want to break the floor. The staircase leads up to that, so he's going to have, like, a big tower leading down to here and up to the main hub. Um, he has a bee farm. I'm planning on making a bee farm at the plantation soon. And he's also got a melon farm. 
the reason he's got this here that he, he made all these farms because as you can see i'll show you right here all these emerald blocks he has a beacon like i stated and he says the cheapest way is to get it via emeralds and trading so that's what he's doing with our villagers up in that little you can't see the building but yeah there's the creek farm um alex is one of the people on here uh we took down one of his houses but he's had like three and he stole caleb's stuff and then you know and it turns out we found out he was hacking so we banned him but he was just unbanned two days ago or was it just yesterday I think it was the last night he was unbanned, and I have not seen if he got on here. But, um, yeah, and there's that copper, uh, that's our uh, courthouse for now. Looks pretty nice on the inside, I'll probably show it another time, because this will be a series, but the first episode is always shown around, so I'll go up this, I guess. Just the beacon. It's very slow, but uh, one day, we're just going to keep just because. Yeah. Uh, whatever way you want to use and then I'm gonna refine up that and then this and then we gotta work on the paths down there make everything look nice okay so we also got the nether but there's nothing in the nether right now we're gonna make like nether highways and stuff maybe we can make the pyramid again anyway this goes to the local plantation I was working on this because that's going to make the path more pretty but uh yeah and i'm wondering what we're going to do with this if they have any plans or if i can take it so right here's a plantation we've been mining down this mountain here and then mining down some over here and filled in some areas um i don't really like these two big walls here but whatever so, uh, we do have an obsolete farm here, but I just have it because it's a snow farm. I mean, do we really need that? I don't know. Chorus fruit farm. And here's the plantation rules. Harvest and replant. Do not grief and do not get hurt. You don't have liability insurance. Uh, sugar cane farm. Beetroot and potato. Wheat. Twisting vines. Or no. Twisting vines, bamboo, cocoa beans, vines, um, stable, carrots, sweet berries, uh, cactus, melons, and pumpkin. He's been harvesting a lot, actually, because he wants to, um, as I said, get the emeralds. Kelp, weeping vines, dripstone, glowberry, drip leaf, and nether wood. And also, I, for, I think you guys might have saw, I didn't point it out, but in that one tunnel, if you go back, that I was talking about, uh, that Caleb was building, he has his flag, and it's the CL flag. And then here we have the, because it's a plantation, but we don't actually, you know, have any slaves or anything. And I'm not a racist, I'm not a confederate, we just have this as a flag for here. It's kind of funny. Maybe not, but whatever. Um, yeah, so there's not much else we got really going for us right now. I mean, it's just starting out, so I'm just going to go ahead and keep working on that little passageway. Got a food here. That is so annoying. I can keep turning that on. So I'm wondering... If I really wanted to keep this cobblestone, I don't know if I really want to. I was thinking about putting spruce wood. Like the logs would look nice, but that'd take a lot of chopping so I wonder if I just turn them into planks use logs as the railing but then we have oak right here that wouldn't look too good would it? I 
don't know what this is down to. You'll probably go get some spruce wood, because I don't got any. I am planning on making orchards too. And then I don't know where I want to build my house. I'm thinking maybe I could build it. Um, thinking about building in the air. So I got a lighter now. I did get um, a lot of armor from Caleb and Ethan in the beginning. They helped support me with a lot of stuff. But um, I did end up getting my own stuff. And then I went to the end got lost for a long time like yeah and then i found my own elytra i still use theirs though because it has mending on it but now i got two we do have a lot of projects that we're working on um one that i'm planning on making is the library the school and the museum and uh caleb's going to be building the museum with me so it's going to be like Big museum, no leak stuff, you know what I'm saying? Oh, I don't need to mind that. That's a big problem. Um, and then we are also, uh, okay, I can put that on. Uh, yeah, we're going to make a church. And then we're also going to make the temple of Wabibi. And so it's actually an inside joke. Wabibi is like a god, I guess. Um, I don't know when we came up with it, but we sacrificed goats to him. So um, I could show you guys his temple, actually. Forgot that was on here. And it, it's not going to be finished till May, according to Caleb, but it's going to be like. He, I've only seen one chamber so far. He's going to make four of them. I don't know if they're all going to look like the same thing, because I think he said that. But either way, we're going to have a sacrifice one. And we're going to try to make it an auto-sacrificer that pulls from, like, the goat farm. And then we're going to have a prayer room. I don't know. What else would you need? A service room? Or, like, you know, <laughs> what do they have at temples? <laughs> but, yeah. Should be fun to see what we make on here, so... We waited. We were going to make this um, back in summer, and then we were like, we should wait for 1.18, or 1.17, I guess. And then they split it in two, and so we waited till Christmas to get the actual caves and mountains. And, well, you know, not exactly Christmas, but I mean, like, cause today's Christmas right now, maybe. But I'm talking like um, Christmas holiday season, you know, whatever, December, whenever it came out. So, yeah. But, um, what was I saying? This always happens to me. It sucks. Alright, so, um, well, they also split it, like, in half again, or, or something, so we're not going to be getting all of it. Um, I am upset about that they removed the, uh, excavation and everything, and the pottery, like, the lore would be crazy, so that's kind of gone. And then Ruined Cities and the Warden, that's all coming in, like, the summer, too, and that sucks, but then I'll be graduated, like, that's very weird feeling, you know. So, yeah. I don't know. What else to think? But, I gotta do something with my life, you know. I don't know what to do. I don't even really edit my videos, I just post them. Someday I can go back and watch them. Even though I won't. I'll leave those ones stoned. My 
ever care to change those one day. Here's some spruce planks. Let's get started. I had a ton of them, and I got rid of them. And that was mainly because I uh, needed a lot of sticks. Like, didn't really need a lot of sticks. I just thought I needed a lot of sticks. I don't know. Okay, it's not that hard to get. Never mind. I just need food now. I do want to get like ice in here though, but I don't know if it'd make it any faster. I also want to get like a railroad up there. Just remembering from sane in the old days. That was nice. Uh, the blue and green one is the steel. That's what we had when we shared a house and had like all the seal kingdom we were trying to make all things same. Should have gotten some better than a cold axe. Pain of a to the pie. Got it from the ruined portal. For mine, I haven't even used it that much beforehand. It's the crazy part. Iron tools actually run out way quicker than I thought they did. Like, I had no idea, but it's it's kind of sad. So then you got to go mining even more. I guess I see why you need iron farms, but you know. So, we're gonna make one of those eventually. I'm also thinking about making a raid farm. The thing is, the materials I need for these farms are way too much. So, I'll actually need to be like hunting out for stuff or make other farms first. And, like, what I really need is a bunch of wood and sand and coal and stuff like that because you know I need to smelt a lot of stuff I need a lot of things that require wood so kind of sucks but you gotta put in the work I guess if you really want it it's just I have existential problems leaving it's not worth it because it's just a game Well, who knows? Is anything really worth it anymore in this world? I don't know. I did um, get a lot of nice stuff for Christmas. And then this light. So you guys can see me again. I don't know why it turns off. <sighs> Got lots of clothes. Got a Kirby game. Also got some light things for my room. And then some more shaving stuff, I guess. What else did I get? Um, candy. I don't know. 
I'm not a fan of candy. Like I kind of like it, but it just makes me stink. Um, I also got this TNT mug over there. Okay, I knew I saw the pack dice somewhere. I, I was thinking earlier before, like days, probably weeks ago, actually. I just now remembered it. Um, because I wanted to make like the ice roads, especially for the nether highways, maybe make them good and whatnot. But, uh, Forgot where to solve them at, and I also don't know how to get them. I think, I think you need silk hunt or something. Hey! So this um, King's block King blocks a lot. He's also a Cobalt Rogue on Fleet Saint for the end of the series. But um. But, uh, sorry, I can't think right now. Oh yeah, he made like the big building and whatnot it was towards the end of the series or the end of the realm. And it was pretty far away. You would have saved up the backup saves. One thing I will say uh, about switching to Java realms is that they don't have the media where you can post pictures on it, like on Bedrock. And I liked that because um, it's like a social media for everyone on the realm. It was like memories. So. Got to get at the right angle here. I don't really care to build up one more block. Okay. Oh, shoot. It is way easier to get wood than I thought. Holy crap. There's no way. What? Yeah, I've been there. Lost in a cave. Oh, crap. And then I was lost in um, the nether which sucked, but I finally found my way back. And just, yeah, someone gave me cords, but that was when they got online. <laughs> and then the end, worst of all of them. Like, terrible. Because I had no idea where I was going. Yeah, it just sucked. I need to get a trident to put Riptide on it, because then I can wear my Elytra and fly in the rain. That'd be nice. I'm surprised my hunger didn't go down. I didn't eat any carrot. Weird. And I've been running now too. What is going on? Just because I didn't notice? Here. Oh, there it is. I don't know what's up with that light. <laughs> Whatever, you know. Okay, let's finish up mining these walls. We'll put them in the walls. Or, I don't know, do we want to do the flooring first? Whatever, I'll turn all this into it. That might be too much, but let's see. It at least looks prettier, you know what I mean? Maybe I'll keep cobblestone for the walls, actually. I don't know. Crap. Yeah, I guess that was already 64. Um, 
enjoying Christmas break, though. Um, I uh, do have a lot of homework that I should have been doing. It's Christmas, I thought. Oh, whatever. Gotta have some fun, I guess. So, tomorrow, I'll force myself to do it. I mean, I gotta. Oh, and then it's, it's finals, and I'm really not looking forward to finals because I'm already not doing too great, and, uh, well, I'll just tell you now that, no, I was saying, so this happens to me, I'm sorry. Why does this happen? Sucks. I'll just restart. Um, I'm already not doing too good in my AP classes, and uh, I don't know why. But yeah, I'm not. So finals gonna drop my grade a ton. Well, hopefully not. But at least I hope they don't affect it at all. Because that would suck. Okay, yeah, we're just gonna keep the cobblestone. Come on. When you pretty stuff up though, it just it is very nice. And then I'll leave this or whatever is to come in this direction. Does anyone else get the opportunity of? I could build something here. Maybe they won't care. But, you know. Castle, though, for myself, even if it looks crappy. Maybe I'll build a castle in the sky. Heck, this is looking nice. We got a pathway now. That actually looks good. People will want to follow it now. Except, we gotta do this. Might have to make another pick here shortly. did here, but fix it up, I guess. There we go. And
do need to make this place look nice. So I'm running out of ideas to do at the plantation. I'm mining down a mountain, but I'm having a second thoughts because I'm like, I could just go get materials for TNT instead. What's more worth it? I do not know. Let me guess the skeleton. I want to turn up all of them, but I might have to. Gonna finish this up real quick and we will go check out his uh, place. For now, I'd like to say that's probably good. Sound. I can't tell if it's from that song. It has to be from this, actually. My vortex lit. ourselves some food, some plantation storage, authorized personnel only, aka me, no one else. Ah! 
Oh, jeez. Okay. Um, what was I grabbing? Just food. That's that's good food right there. And you know what? We will uh, take some coarse fruit. No, probably less than that, just to mess with them. Okay. Um, Do I need anything else? Let's just store all this stuff then. time for Christmas dinner soon so um yeah I'm trying to mine down a lot of this mine down uh, this to flatten it out oh and filled in some of that area leads into this cave here and this goes from the top of that mountain to the bottom of the world like bedrock bedrock and so it's so insane in here and massive Ethan, the owner of the realm and everything, is going to make a dwarven city in here. So here's the bedrock and everything. And you can't really see it, but if you get around here, it goes all the way up. So, yeah. I'm not sure exactly what he's planning on doing with these big, exactly, structures. But, uh, he's doing that, and I found out it connects right into the plantation. So I thought, well... I'm gonna mine out part of the mountain. Okay, he just left. I'm gonna mine out part of the mountain, just making an entrance into the city, maybe. I know his property is most likely over here. Also, I don't think Ethan has a house. And I don't have a house besides bed in that plantation. So that actually marks off King Blocks a lot's territory from mine, I guess. So kinda sucks. I don't have to buy these flowers from them now. Or just claim they weren't there in my photos. <laughs> uh for the bee farm that is. So okay, he's got another portal. I'm gonna have to make a way to that in the nether. But let's see what he's got going on here. A nice portal here. So it looks like he's got a nice little, uh, oh, I forgot barrels. I need one. And he's got this. Sweet. I'm trying to see if I can teleport into this house here. God, he has windows like this. He really likes making sexual architectures. It's nice.
What is this? Can you make it do that? How do you control this stuff? Yeah, I'm planning on more egg on the floor. So, we'll see. If you guys ever remember that uh that video I made on that server is like an avatar element bending server. So um basically he was on that one and uh he got me to join it and I took my paths from there and he I think I've shown you guys his place, maybe not. But it was pretty cool. It um, worked like that, but way bigger. He had massive castle and an underground obsidian fortress. I mean, it was insane. He had like, oh man, the stuff he does is cool. Eventually, we're going to cultivate this entire island here, full continent. We will have a big dwarven city on the inside, a whole plantation. And he'll be over here with his stuff. Uh, King Block is a lot. We'll have a main city, I guess. I, I don't know. Temple of Wabibi. And then maybe we'll go farther, or maybe not. Some up there, you know, I I've been thinking if I should build my house there. Should I go take a look at it? Why not? Let's go take a look at it. Because, I mean, I'm going to terraform this, put grass on it. All the way over here, though, I don't think I am. But do I want to have my house in the sky or on the land, or do I want to have two houses? I really want to make a fly flying island, or like a couple of them. I don't know how to do that, though. So let's see. 
I mean, it's not going to be that big of a terraforming deal. How much land is there over here? Okay. And then it just goes down, and there's like an island right there. You know what? I think it's... I think it's a good place for a house and we can have just a cabin right there oh uh, also they do have um one player sleep on so if one person sleeps in the bed it turns to daytime and it's not a data pack anymore minecraft added that to the settings the command so yes it is command to turn it on but that's all ethan's the only one with access to commands and we trust him to not cheat so I don't take him as the cheating type. So, yeah. Anyhow, I'm going to go reset my spawn point, and I will see you guys in the next video. Can't wait to see what projects we got in the future for this channel. If there's anything else you guys want to see me do on this channel, uh, this camera is terrible. If there's anything you guys want to see me do on this channel in the future, um, let me know, and uh, yeah, I'll see about it. Games and whatever, and uh, certain challenges with the game, and if it's a reaction, or sometimes gaming, I might not put it on this channel, but if I put out my other one, check out Randonarchy because I do education, challenges, gaming, reactions, music, um, I don't know, I only have two songs on there. They suck. But you check out my brother, uh, Commander X. Um, I don't know how you can find him besides like my subscriptions or something, but he you could look it up. I think it'll show. Commander B or Commander X. It's like a I don't know how to explain it. It's like red and blue and black. So I think there's a sword and a shield. Anyway. He makes his music's not the best, but it's better than mine. So it's nothing professional, but it's pretty good, so you should check him out. Uh, we're going to start using some of his music in our skits. And, uh, I don't know, hoping to make more music. So, yeah, anything you guys want to see us do on the realm, maybe? I mean, really, right now, my plans are just make as many farms as possible, and then auto farms. And then I also want to make my house and a castle and floating islands, and we want to make the massive museum. And, I mean, this museum that we're planning to do, it's going to look beautiful. It's going to have an entrance area. It's going to have a place for the past and stuff. We're going to have a place for the realm itself. So basically like this person, this happened on this date, you know, stuff like that. Flags for different things, location coordinates, and special dates. And then we're going to have a place for Minecraft itself. So the overworld, the nether, and the end. And when you go to the end, you're going to have, well, the normal end. It's going to say blah, blah, blah. On this date, maybe they fought the Ender Dragon. It's going to have a small little section that looks like the end biome. And then they're going to have course fruit area and then uh, city and city place. And it's going to look like you're inside one of the buildings or something. So, yeah, that's, uh, that's going to be a less small section. And then we're going to have the nether. And like the entrance into the nether area is going to be an unlit nether portal. And probably have some like purple glass on it when you go through the part that isn't glass and then um yeah we're gonna have another section so we're gonna have another wasteland in the middle because that's from the original before all the biomes that's gonna split off into all the different biomes and we're gonna have small sections that look like the biomes to explain some stuff and then we're going to have see I don't know how to get like it would be cool if we could get statues of the mobs we can't do that maybe you can trap the mobs and we're going to try and make a zoo for every single mob, every single animal, and enemy, probably. Maybe not every enemy. Ender Dragon Wither, Ghast, but you know what I mean, a lot of them. Um, and then we're going to have uh, an aquarium, too. So, massive zoo and aquarium. It's going to be amazing. And then uh, there's also going to be the overworld section, which is split into... Um, continental and oceanic section. So oceanic, you get the ocean, you get the islands, the pirate ships, underneath the ocean, the coral reefs, and there's not really any biomes, but you know, kelp forests, something like that. It may explain some stuff. 
Oh, and uh, Ocean Monument, things like that. Small little things. Rooms that look like them. That area. It's like a model of it. And then we're going to have the land biomes with the wood and fake villages. And yeah, it's going to be hopefully amazing. And then the school. School is not going to be a big school. Uh, for now, it would be a small school. Maybe we'll make it to one with a bunch of classrooms and a gym and everything. That'd be cool. But uh, for now, uh, it's not in the plans. But yeah, now I'm thinking about it. Yeah, that'd be cool. And uh, the Dwarven City is going to be amazing to have, too. It'll make it feel like there's actually a town there. And then I'll have my house. Well, I'll have our houses. We'll have the main center hub area looking good. We'll have a massive boat in the front. It's going to hopefully be good. Uh, just a second. Okay. And then, um, what else was I planning on doing? Oh, yeah, the library. We're going to try and make it look like the Library of Alexandria and whatever, and the one from the TARDIS. Massive bookshelves. We're going to have a bunch of books you can take. But we're going to have, like, a Library of Congress type thing. If you don't know what that is, it's a library of the main copies of everything, not everything, but a lot of things like movies and songs. They wanted to get uh, George Lucas to give them the original Star Wars, and he said nope. And this is because George Lucas has changed Star Wars a lot. You cannot find the original version anymore. It's pretty hard because he's changed it. You can look up what I mean. So, um, yeah, he changed a lot of it, and uh, he said nope, and they're like, well, we won't take it, and you won't have it saved here forever. And I don't know why he did not want to give them the original, but, like, come on, just give them the original, and then you can still publish your other ones that people can watch, <laughs> whatever. We're going to have that for the original copies, and then make other copies people can buy from the library and whatnot, and just borrow from the library too if they don't want to buy it. But I mean, <laughs> Minecraft is so easy to get stuff. We don't know if we're going to have a money system or not. We're going to have a massive bank, a uh, jail cell, courthouse, based off the one in our town. It's uh, hopefully going to be good. Uh, hotel, um, party area, statues. A hospital, um, some houses besides the dwarven ones that people may want to live in. I don't know. You will see how many people get on here. I mean, there's a lot of people, and I have not met all of them, but there's a lot of people that are joining here. Um, some people from the last one that did not join, but a lot of people from there did, and a lot of new people. So, uh, ready to see where this goes. Anyway, guys, see you next time.